morning everyone. I uh, it's, it's day five. It's like super early in the morning, 6.30 in the morning on day five. Um, but I'm just checking in for day four at this point. And I'm gonna check in for day five later. But I want you to know that it's technically day five. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Uh, so yesterday was a big day. Um, as I'd anticipated, I had uh, the Dungeons and Dragons session. Uh, my intention originally was to wake up early that day and do uh, my half hour, um, but I wasn't feeling completely prepared for the game. Um, mainly just a lot of um, anxiety, nerves about the the actual game, and you know, playing with people that I've never met. Um, just made me want to make sure that I was, you know. The most ready that I could possibly be, um, you know, running through the campaign again and um, making sure I had everything, etc. Uh, and then um, the session started at one, and then um, I wanted to do something with with my girls, um, with Jazz and April. So um, we went out and just did some stuff, just like did a bit of shopping and just hung out together, got some lunch. Um, just yeah, nothing too crazy just you know just just so we could you know, spend a little bit of time together away from the house and then got home pretty much got home packed my bags and left and then had D&D from there on uh, up until uh, didn't end till seven o'clock so it's about six hours of D&D which was awesome um, the group was actually really fantastic uh, we all got along really well um, just a bunch of 30 something dudes like myself um, so it was a real pleasant game um, almost felt bad because um, this was actually a, um, they paid me to be their, their dungeon master, um, which I was just absolutely chuffed about that people were willing to let me be a dungeon master. Um, it definitely boosted my confidence a little bit more, you know, knowing that I could sort of jump into people I never knew and still be able to manage a, a, a group of people. And some of them were a little bit difficult, some of them were really into it, some of them were just kind of there to be there. Um, but overall, like at the end of it, they were just like, that was really fun. Thank you, know, thank you so much. So, um, yeah, chuffed, stoked that that worked out well. By the end of it, I was um, just absolutely exhausted. So, got home, scoffed down some dinner, uh, and then um, we promised April to do movie time. Uh, so, movie time for us is literally, as it sounds, it's just movie night. You know, so we all just hang out on the couch, we get the blankets out. Um, we get all the snacks, chips, and popcorn, and chocolate, and we just hang out on the couch, and we just pick a movie, and each time it's a new movie, and we try and encourage April to watch movies that she's never watched before, um, or might not consider watching, so like last night we watched The Wind in the Willows, uh, or as I believe in America it's called Mr. Toad's Wild Ride, um, which I found out on IMTV yesterday, uh, but yeah, yeah, we watched like Bed Nobs and Brew, so more the live action kids stuff that came out in you know the 80s and 90s uh, and uh, the noughties you know that we enjoyed um, you know this is our way to introduce them to her and if she likes them she likes them she doesn't she doesn't she's she's got her own um, passions for you know cartoons and shows so you know we don't force them on her but um, she does enjoy them and really it's just a chance for her to, to stay up late I think she just that you know that's the excitement for her is getting to stay up late with mum and dad and watch a movie so yeah uh, so in that time, um, apart from trying not to fall asleep, uh, I had to push myself and I managed to get the iPad out and do, uh, it was probably just under 30 minutes, uh, if I'm being honest with myself, uh, maybe 20 to 25 minutes of work. Um, I can't show it because I'm in here and I couldn't film it because I was on the couch. Um, I had nowhere to put a camera uh, to film it. Um, but I hope you can trust me to say that I did do it. Um, I actually continued work on the, uh, so that panel with all the characters that I was working on like in day one, um, and then I'd roughed out, like I'd relayed out that bottom section. Um, I was uh, working on that and actually um, building up the detail on the characters. Yeah, so that's where I am. Um, I realized at this point that I actually haven't uploaded day, oh no, I've uploaded day three, but I haven't sent it through to um, public. So it's just sitting there. Um, so when these go up, including day five later today, you guys are going to be like, man, that's, that's just going to bombard you. No, I apologize in advance. Um, but today, today's going to be a busy day. As I mentioned, I am off to the market. So that's why it's so early. Um, 
it's at 6.30, well it's past 6.30 now, um, but I'm on my way to the Akuna Market in Berwick, um, this is my second time at the market, last week I did really well, um, considerably really well, um, hopefully this week goes even better. The weather is looking pretty good, I was a bit concerned because we've had some torrential rain uh, the past couple of days, uh, it's meant to calm down but it's meant to be windy, but from what I can tell of the wind so far, it's nothing compared to what the wind was like last week, um, and I hadn't started these videos last week so you have no idea what I'm talking about, but we had like just gale force winds, and where my table is, I'm in the shed, but I'm right uh, near the door, so um, every time we would just get one of those giant blasts of wind, everything would just fly everywhere and it was a disaster. So I'm hoping that today is going to be a little bit more forgiving. I'm hoping that these clouds don't deter too many people. Um, I've had a few family and friends say that they're going to come down today, which is great. Um, I'm currently on my own. Usually I have uh, my friend Chris who would sit there, but he's not there. Um, it's actually his birthday tomorrow, so he is uh, doing family stuff, um, which is great. Um, so this will be an interesting challenge for me to set up on my own, mainly just to cart everything on my own, um, I think is my biggest concern. Um, I'm actually going to see if I can try and cart it all in one hit, but this makes me realise that I definitely need to look into getting a trolley. Um, but everything fits into one container, so um, if I remember I'll try and film all of it uh, when I, you can probably see in the back there, yeah, so that little tub there. That sort of spans the whole back, and then I've got some um, wooden crates and stuff which sit in the um, in the boot, and they just stack on top anyway. Just adds a bit of weight, but um, one quick walk it'll just make it a little bit easier for me than not having to run back and forth. Um, yeah. Anyway, so that's me. That was day four. Uh, day five is about to begin. I do have my iPad with me, so during the quiet times I do intend to sketch. Um, I haven't decided if I'll work on Monkey Junk while I'm there um, or whether or not I'll work on some other designs um, but I'm hoping that like just by sitting there drawing people will actually realize that uh, one of the problems I had last week at a market was people didn't realize I was the artist and um, I sort of had to explain like yeah hey I'm the artist. Um, I actually said last week and I realized like it was kind of a silly thing like I'm the illustrator and I feel like I should be like yeah I'm the artist. I do these, so I think that would just translate a bit better for people who aren't sure, you know, what an illustrator is or does. Um, it seems common sense to me, but you just don't know. So, artist, keep it generic. This is art, and I made it, <laughs> and then hopefully generate a conversation after that. Anyway, off to the market. I'm going to finish my coffee. I've got a muffin here. This is my breakfast. Thank you, Seven Eleven, for sorting me out. <laughs> and uh, off I go to hopefully um, sell some art and uh, make my visit, make my visit, make my business uh, a success. Um, I'll catch you all later today slash tomorrow for day five.